Shed when the coast is clear. There'll be a deputy waiting for you. Dude, I don't Thank know you. Why sometimes Twitch keeps kicking me off, off, man. Damn nation! Uh, you, uh, you know what? Skip that. I'm, <laughs> I'm sorry, Mon. Dude, I kept like either shooting her or he shoots her. Or <laughs> Mano, are you gonna do something today? Some kind of stream? That's what There's I was asking for. Government payroll, taking money that the rest of us have to pay for with our lives. Yeah. What is wrong with this country? Hold up, men. The man that kills the boss of that bunch gets fifty dollars. It ain't about the money, Marshal. These are people's lives, people's homes. <laughs> Let's go. Get on your horse, boy. All right, let's find those bastards. Come on. Do you think they might be headed for Fort Mercer, Marshal? What? Williamson's men? Maybe. All this sure looks I like their handiwork. Um, I ended up putting this back on the Come light. on, Marshal. This might when be I our loaded, chance. Um, Quality for some reason they kept kicking me off the bridge. I'm not even joking. Let's just whatever. say he's the currency in a complicated transaction. What the hell you talking about? Some Get people on. I have the displeasure of knowing want him dead. Why does that involve you? We used to run in a gang together. He was once like family. If this is how you treat your family, I'd hate to see what you do to your enemies. That was a lifetime ago. And bear in mind. Left me for dead the last two times I've seen him. Wait, who's that up there? You just oh, walk shit. away now, John. I didn't kill you before, but I sure as shit will now. Get yourself down here, Bill. You know you ain't man enough to stop me. <laughs> you know I don't want to kill you, but I will. You always did have a high opinion of yourself, John. <laughs> Dutch always said you were an arrogant son of a bitch. I guess he was about right. Get him, boys! Everybody, take cover! In that shed! This way! We'll make our stand here. Stay in cover and watch your head! Oh my god! Let's go! Yeah. Fuck!
Anyone still moving? Or am I done here? Hey, look what I got here. There's something that you're still breathing. Come here, boy. Come on, Bessie. Give. Oh. Norman Deke. Fuck. Nice to see you again, buddy. Thanks for your help, John. Norman here is gonna help us get to Bill. Ain't you, Norman? Thank you, Mr. Dick. Mighty kind. <laughs> Fuck you! Hell yeah. Hog time. Bitches seen Let's some get some dirty times, Mono. Let's go! Oh shit. Here, all I need is eight more dollars, man. Maybe one of these guys. So what, Bonnie's up now? You okay, lady? <laughs> My husband's missing. <laughs> These bastards won't do anything. But he's a good man. He don't drink nor lay with whores. And he's been, he's been missing for three days. <laughs> Let me guess. You went missing up in the hills? How did you know, mister? Just a guess. If I find him, I'll bring him back to you. But people seem to go missing up there. Got much money, and I'm with the family way again. As I said, I'll do what I can. That bounty stole there when I come back. I'll do that. I'll start working on those. Yeah. I think I like to do the side missions as they uh, pop up. Because there's only so many of them in this game. It's not that many. It's not as bad as some. City fella broke my leg. What? He broke my leg. Some city fella. Guy got creepy on me. And then he got violent. When? Just now. Uh, he ran off that way. Can't have gone too far. I find him, I'll bring him back this way. Is that Thank the same you, dude that had us go by the property, but I shot him? You're getting your hog tie again, uh, Mana. Don't take me back to that man.
Please. I'll do anything. This is a nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, dang. Why don't you have some, uh... Why are you wanting to do all this, like, mean stuff? I'm trying to have the good on her, uh... <laughs> Broke this oh, no. poor fool's oh, leg, mister. This maniac tried to eat me. We've got cannibals in these here hills. Please help me. Please. What? Please. Fella's got to eat now. Fella's got to eat. Ah, <laughs> Asprey, please. Please. <laughs> Damn you all. Oh, hell. Hard today. <laughs> I, I, I couldn't let that happen, man. I already killed the one guy by mistake. Is it like at a certain time or whatever I can't do uh bounds? Oh uh, what it probably is is when the police station's open or whatever. Alright, yeah, see last night I thought I ruined the um by shooting the one guy by having a too low morale or whatever. I thought I ruined the chance of doing bounds. Okay, yeah, no. Okay, cool. There's like 13 here and like another 6 in Mexico or whatever. Doing a fine job. <laughs> what do you want on your tombstone, Mana? Let's go. There's like maybe like 16 of these total in the game, so it's not many. You know, it's not. You know. Um, I'll try to capture the bounties, but you know, shit happens. Oh, yeah. Come on. 
me, Red Dio would be Red or Red Dead too. I don't think I like the story better. I mean, I like both, but. Hell yeah, Mono, can you make that for us? <laughs> What about you, Red Dog? Which one would you, uh, play? I mean, well, just, see... It also depends what mood I'm in. For the most part, I like single-player games better, so the Red Dead 2 would be it. But for the one time I'm into playing multiplayer, I would have to pick GTA 5. Just because the, uh, the story is good, you know, the online is so great, you know. You found that no-good piece of dirt. <laughs> Vice City, no, I'm gonna get the remaster when it comes out in October. I always wanted to play them. In three. So I don't know if another one will pop right away or not. I know in Mexico you can do them back to back basically. Damn. Okay, yeah, I kind of want to do the Bonnie mission. See if another bounty would pop. Mono or Red Dead, did you ever, or Red Dead, damn. Mono or Red Dead, did you ever play uh, and beat Vice City? was supposed to be back hours ago. I don't know. The ranch hands have been out looking, but so far they've found nothing. Well, come on. Let's go look for him. Let's head out. He couldn't have gotten far. Please hurry. He's been gone for hours. Dude, yeah, I, I won't ever, I 100% of this go. game, Red Dead 1, and GTA 5, I 100%, uh, but never again. Now, it's like, I'll do the main missions and maybe the, the like, all the side missions, and, and even in this game, there's a side mission where, like, you have to collect so many shit, and uh, GTA is worse. Like, I won't, it's fine. Like, I don't... And in this game, you need to hunt and everything to hunt and it now. Nah. I'm kidding, man. I've got a bad feeling like, I'll about play this. it. It's not you know, like him to be like, away for so long. And I feel like don't I've worry. gotten we'll find my value. He's not as young as he used to, to be. What like if he's hurt himself? Like, you don't get your value if you don't hunt or fine, or whatever. But, dude, like... like for Come a game that's a story, like, okay, if I feel like I got to the end of the story and then... Like, I, I play it till I feel like I'm done. Stay with me. That's all I'm saying. Come on, let's hurry! Daddy! What happened? Nothing nice. Wrestlers, I guess. Maybe the Baller twins, that bunch. Now you head back to the ranch right now and fetch your wagon. Yes, sir. Marson, you watch after her. I'll do that, sir. It's a bad idea. Please stay close. What could have happened to those poor men? And the horses like, were dead, yeah, too. Doing, like, I think we should get back there as soon as we can. Who could have provision. done something like that? Your boss seemed to have an idea who it was. Let's just do what he says and get the wagon. Get up! Those damn horses! 
Damn, rustlers. I've got a good mind to head over to Pike's Basin myself. I don't think that's a good idea. And you're no better. How many men have you killed? Do you really want to know? It's disgusting. You never met the men I killed. I heard the way you talk about that gang you were in. Like there was some twisted morality to what you did. Oh, only some of us don't realize. The outlaw with the code? How wonderfully romantic. The reluctant murderer. Oh my god! The barn's on fire! Yeah! Let's go! Acting the in the barn is on fire. This game or uh what is it? Somebody this ain't working! The doors are blocked! Put we need off. to find another way in! It's getting worse! Mr. Marston, please! See if you can get in through the get little move! Oh, oh this game. I'm sorry. Yeah, you can see it. I like it. I mean like maybe I'm just too you know, fanboy. Yes, John, thanks. You... If you'll excuse me. Well, hold on a second over there. Farley, all the damage. That gang seems to... Frighten me. Good. Oh, that. I think you got enough, Dad. You saved my life. Get my farm stuff for doing business people I know. Um, well, you get some. Get out. I don't have a clue. All right, but it's got to be something to do with that government boy. Talk to him. Find I think there's like knows. one more mission with Bonnie after this. Who? Um, oh, my daughter, you fucking scum! Where's Bonnie? I don't know. I haven't seen her since after the fire. Why? Why? Because she hadn't been seen since yesterday afternoon. 
You know, I don't think I can cope. If I lose another child... Now, Drew, it, nobody's lost anything yet. I'm sure she's fine. Oh, Mr. Marshall! Mr. Marshall! Come out, come out, wherever you are! Oh, cool, cool. What the hell's that? Hey, buddy! <laughs> that be your next fucking bear. Even better! Good day, Mr. McFarlane! Get down from that horse, boy. Or I have I'll one shoot. more mission with him. <laughs> I wouldn't recommend that, mister. And then we're working on a... Not we're like Drew halfway through the first to see chapter. Pony back in one piece. Hey, Mr. McFarlane! It's a nice girl you got there. I have missions with, uh, there. Nigel. You know, I have one more with some Marshall after this. I just marry her and then I have missions with Give Nigel and then that. another guy. What and then I'm want? in Mexico already. That's better. I want Norman Deke. I want him set free. Then you'll get your daughter back, mister. We don't do deals with outlaws, boy. Yeah, you do! Let's not waste each other's time pretending otherwise. Whole government themselves ain't much more than a bunch of crooks. This is the land of opportunity, mister. And I'm giving you the opportunity to get your daughter back before 15 friends of mine take out all their anger and their loneliness on her. Where the hell is she? Where is she, boy? Bring Deke up to Tumbleweed in a couple hours. And don't get no funny ideas, or I will slit that horse throat myself! You boys have a pleasant afternoon. Yeah! What do we do? We do as he says. You and me, Marshal. Mr. McFarland, I'll get you your daughter back. I owe her that. Please do. I'll teach you some respect for the law. My no. Hurry up, boy. Let's go. Quick as you can, deputy. Make sure he's tied on good. Stay with me, Marston. I won't let anything happen to her, sir. Come on, let's ride hard to Tumbleweed. This is what happens when the Federals interfere in our affairs. Are you happy now? No, I ain't happy at all. I told you, I ain't with the government. Now you say that, John, but the only thing I know for sure is who sent you. They made me come here. They gave me no choice. That's your government, Mr. They come down here dressed as cocky as the King of Diamonds, talking a lot of flannel about helping us, about spreading peace and civilization to the West, but they brought nothing but trouble. Be with you. Wolves in sheep clothing, all of them. Rob you, then make you pay to have someone investigate the crime on your behalf. People around here have been fooled into feeling protected when they're worse off than they were before. The fellas I know don't care about people. All they care about is lining their pockets. Why is this sorry son of a bitch so important to them? Norman Deke Williamson Rand. In other words, a glorified... Wait, boy. Marshal! I'll be back for you! Bill's standards have slipped. We already filled you with lead once, you ugly bastard! This is the kind of man who's mean enough to be second in command, but too coward to ever be a leader. Don't ever use that line near your deputies. You know, for his sake, They'd best not have laid a finger on Miss McFarland. Come on. What is this place we're headed? Tumbleweed? A lonely, godforsaken place. Some people say it's haunted. It was quite a town back in its day. Then they built the railroad to Armadillo and went clean past Tumbleweed. And that was that. Pretty soon, everybody had up and left. Now it's just thieves, smugglers, and bandits. Scum like Deke here. Oh, popular spot for lynchings, too. Let's try to avoid that if we can, Marshal. I just hope you're not taking advantage of the McFarlands, Marston. They saved my life. Gave me food and bed when they had no idea who I was. I owe them more than I could ever repay. I'm through a lot. Well, 
They're both vulnerable, in different ways. I wouldn't have been running in and out of a burning barn to save their horses otherwise. I know you helped, just like you helped me. But you got your reasons for doing it. It's no secret why I'm here, Marshal. I told you the very first time I walked into your office. I trust you. It's just all this business with Blackwater and Williamson and the past. I don't know. Sometimes it's hard not to have doubts. Spinning an out to the work of a lawman. That's madness. Rancher girl, fuck so good. Why don't you save some of that breath? We